How do you improve your luck? There's basically three people, three kinds of people. They say there's no such thing as luck. That's one kind. Second person is like, oh, luck is just good timing. It's just being at the right place at the right time. Another group of people say, say luck doesn't exist. You can only bless by God. Only God can make you blessed. What I'm saying is that well, luck is actually being able to access those deeper states of consciousness that give you that super intelligence. If you don't think it exists, then that doesn't make any sense because why do people win the lottery? Why do people meet the special someone that uh, is their soulmate? Well, there's got to be luck. The second type of people say that luck is just good timing. How did you have the intuition to know that that was the right time and right place? You may say, "Oh, uh, I really thought about it a lot, or I really planned it out a lot." But then there's an element that we don't have control over. Yes, preparation is good, but there's also that element of luck, also that element of intuition that is going to make you more successful than you normally would be. And the third type of person is the people that say luck doesn't exist. Well, if luck exists, then who created it? We say God created everything, so God created luck too, right? God created good fortune. He created good luck, so you can call it blessed. Like being blessed, that means that you have the favor of God, God shining down on you. So what I'm saying is just a different terminology. So you're gonna have a voice in your mind that's going to tell you where to go. What do you call that? You call it the voice of God. Why not call it intuition? You call it God's grace, God's favor. Well, you can call it luck too. So we're really talking about the same things.